The National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health describes methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus as a potentially dangerous type of staph bacteria. Staph, which is commonly carried on the skin or in the nose of healthy people, can sometimes cause infections. In fact, staph bacteria are one of the most common causes of skin infections in the United States, but most of these infections are minor. However, with MRSA, which are types of staph that are resistant to an antibiotic known as methicillin, and often resistant to other antibiotics as well, the infections can become serious, sometimes even fatal. NIOSH reports that MRSA usually spreads by touching infected skin, but it can also spread by touching materials or surfaces that have had contact with an infection. This is why MRSA infections can spread in the workplace. NIOSH states that certain factors make it easier for it to spread and lists their five C's, which include crowding, frequent skin-to-skin -skin contact, compromised skin, contaminated items and surfaces, and lack of cleanliness. While healthcare facilities have infection control procedures due to the unique challenges they face from MRSA and other superbugs, other workplaces where the five C's may be common include schools and daycare facilities, dormitories, military barracks, and correctional facilities, reports NIOSH. In addition, people who work with farm animals or pets may also be at risk of MRSA infections. It is safe to work with someone who has a staph or MRSA infection as long as their wound is kept clean, dry, and covered according to NIOSH. The agency also provides guidance for employers and supervisors to help prevent the spread of staph or MRSA in the workplace. There are also recommendations for workers to prevent these types of skin infections. These are just a few of the many things to know about MRSA and the workplace. To learn more about this or other infection control, building science, occupational, environmental, health, or safety issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.